Sometimes in the game of football, there are moments that occur that define your season. On Saturday, as the Kansas football team routed Louisiana Tech 29 zip, it just so happens there is one of those moments for the Jayhawks. Midway through the third, following Desmond Briscoe's 48 yard touchdown reception, Louisiana Tech's Philip Livis was determined to break KU's shutout. Off the handoff from Taylor Bennett, Livis was 80 yards to Paydard, but what he didn't expect was a streaking Daryl Stuckey. Down to the KU two yard line, Stuckey made the touchdown saving tackle, preserving perfection for the Jayhawk defense. I think the, 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 the guttiest play in the game of football is when a player is out in the open running for a touchdown and you're the only guy that can make the play and you, you, you don't have as, as steep as angles you'd like to have. You have everything going against you, but yet you go down and make the play. Leave us nine out of ten times without running that angle to, to the end zone. And Daryl just showed the fortitude that he was going to make that play. When I first took off, I saw number six, and I was like, oh, man, he's fast. He's the fast person on our team. But as um, soon as he took off, as soon as I started taking off, I just was like, man, this is going to be a race. And um, I'm now wishing that I would have ran towards the pylon sooner instead of running towards him and running a banana route. But it's one of those things to where when he started looking back, that's when I started gaining confidence that, oh, he's slowing down. He's going to slow down. He can't look back. He ain't speed up. So I felt good about it. Stucky and the Jayhawks play next on Friday night at 7 against South Florida. You can see the game live on ESPN. That's Sunflower Broadband Channel 33.